today is the reunion at Atlantic College and it's about reconnecting and reuniting people. So basically it's set up with a lot of activities so people can re-experience what they experienced 30, 40 or 20 years ago. It's a combination of talks from the senior leadership team, of people meeting up and chatting to each other and of outdoor activities where people can go kayaking, climbing, play, playing volleyball. Also in the evening there's going to be a gala dinner which is going to be very nice to see people in a different circumstance. Well, it's always great to be back at uh, Atlantic College because it's, uh, as I used to say, um, a magic place. Um, it did change, I think, uh, all of my life and I'm hugely grateful for having had the opportunity to have come here and also hugely grateful for having uh, had Caroline attend the same school and, um, of course, I'm very proud of her as well. I think the best thing about my time here was probably just the unity, the constant feeling that I was being challenged and stretched every single day, whether it was helping people learn to swim or receiving help to do better in some of my subjects. That intense pressure cooker of, of incredible people in such a small, incredible environment. Um, I've never had that since, and it, it was such a privilege to have been able to take part and be here. You know, the most exciting thing I found about this college was the diversity of the college. You know, you know the, the wide you know, variety of cultures, people, ethnic groups. It's made me less xenophobic. So, and I think that's actually great because it contributes to uh, world peace, uh, understanding, and it, you know, it helps to build goodwill amongst the various people that make up this planet. The two years here at college, I mean, for me, it was. Um just what I've dreamt of, you know. I always wanted to see the world and understand how people think and feel. And if I see how many UWC students I'm befriended with now, and they're either from my year or other years, they're 25, they're 20, and they're really close friends. So it's not just the bunch you were close to during um, those two years, but it's an open world and you can reconnect. Today is exceptional. It's not just reliving the past, Relatively few of my year come back because there are very few of us. But you come back and you talk to the students and they're fantastic. They're from all walks of life. It, to me, it's a great learning curve, if nothing else. And if I can impart a bit of my knowledge to them, I'd, I'd love to. I wouldn't be a better human being if I hadn't had the opportunity to come here at age 16. You know, just, just doing what you can. The little bit, it's not always about money, it's about what you can do to help your community and the, the kids who we, we, we allow to, to go to these wonderful schools. The world needs more enlightened, more aware people. So you, you're helping the greater good. One of the best things about reunion is to come back and, and to, to really remember that, that most of us would never be the people we are today without the school and, and everybody deserves an opportunity for that and for that we need to keep giving back. It's so inspiring to hear from friends that I haven't spoken to in 10 years that they're doing incredible things and, 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 and really changing their world and, and their communities and making a huge difference. And, you know, it, it, it makes me so proud to be part of this group that is, that is, that is really going out there and seizing the day. I mean, it's, it's fantastic. <laughs>